क्वेश्चन 156 सिलेक्ट अ नॉन एरोमेटिक अमीनो एसिड फिनाइल एलानिन एलानिन टाइरोसिन ट्रिप्टोफान Aromatic amino acid students possess a cyclic structure with a side chain which bears a carboxylic and an amino group. The examples of aromatic amino acids are tyrosine, tryptophan, and phenylalanine. Aromatic. So looking at the option this is aromatic this is also aromatic and tryptophan is also aromatic whereas alanine is a neutral amino acid it has one amino group and one carboxylic group so and also it does not show any cyclic structure thus the correct answer here would be option number 2 alanine question number 157 select the incorrect match lecithin is a phosphoglyceride or a phospholipid that's correct option 2 competitive inhibition decrease in km and vmax value looking at the graph obtained when we use a competitive inhibitor this dark line represents the reaction progress when it is without a competitive inhibitor and with a competitive inhibitor more substrate is needed to reach the half maximal velocity but vmax is still obtained km is changed but vmax is still attained the km is changed but vmax is not changed an option to read the decrease in km and vmax both that's what makes it incorrect option 3 heterocyclic rings adenine and guanine yes these are the rings made up of at least two different atoms so they are called heterocyclic rings and fourth option coenzymes we know that the essential components of many coenzymes are vitamins so that is also correct the correct answer here would be option 2 because that's incorrect answer is 2 question 158 activity of a simple non allosteric enzyme is not affected by change in temperature ph substrate concentration product concentration students the question is emphasizing on a non allosteric enzyme and what are the factors which are not affecting it students as we know allosteric enzymes show feedback mechanism and by feedback mechanism we mean that one of the products which is formed during the chain of the metabolic reaction either acts as a modulator or as a inhibitor so the product plays an important role here but not all products only one of the products which are formed in the reaction but here the enzyme is non allosteric so product concentration would not play any role let's look at the options first temperature temperature would play a role in the activity of the enzyme ph as well and substrate concentration as well just like any other enzyme activity but product concentration would not be playing any role here since it's a non allosteric enzyme thus the right answer would be option number 4 product concentration answer is 4 159 which of the following statements is wrong we are looking for an incorrect statement here let's go over the options one by one hydrogen bonds are crucial for stabilizing the alpha helical structure in a given protein that's true students the alpha helical structure of a protein is stabilized by the presence of hydrogen bonds which makes it a correct option transient state structure of the substrate formed during an enzymatic reaction is high energy and unstable that is also right the enzyme substrate complex which is formed during the reaction is unstable and has very high energy to it this is also correct option 3 complementary base pairing is applicable to rna if needed that is right rna is usually a single stranded structure but complementary base pairing is possible in it with the help of hydrogen bonds that is also correct four concanavalin a is a lectin which is categorized as a primary metabolite concanavalin is a lectin but it is not a primary but a secondary metabolite so this is incorrect the correct answer here would become option number 4 answer is 4 
Question 160. Select the correct match based on graph given. The given graph represents percentage of the total cellular mass of living tissues on y-axis and components on x-axis and there are bars given in the descending order. In the NCRT students, in the biomolecule chapter students, a table is presented which reads components and percent of the total cellular mass. We see water is maximum 70 to 90 percent of the case so that would represent in the graph this that is A. Protein is second highest that would be B. C would be nucleic acid because it's more 5 to 7 percent that would be C, D, E and F so on. So let's look at the options now. A represents proteins that's incorrect. A represents water E is lipids, that's correct. B, protein, that's incorrect because it says nucleic acids here and C would be nucleic acid but it gives ions here which is represented by F here. So that is also incorrect. The correct option here would be option number 2, E, lipids. Answer is 